this is an example of being an early adopter. Fairly expensive microphone. I think I was one of the first to buy this hardware rev. It turns out modern day USB technology throws this guy for a loop. But we are not here to talk about microphones. Let's take another look at how to buy Bitcoin. What's up, everybody? Welcome back. Thanks for joining me for yet another installment in how to buy Bitcoin. Yesterday, I recorded, produced a video that was focused on helping you navigate the process for buying Bitcoin. And as I thought about it, I didn't really like where that left you. In that video, I utilized Coinbase, which is incredibly easy to use. And you can buy not just Bitcoin, but a whole bunch of other cryptos. I'm going to link to that video up here. Definitely worth checking out. But hopefully you see this one first. This one we're going to talk about how to buy Bitcoin, but we're going to do so in a way that puts you in an immediate position to protect your coins. Again, the old adage is not your keys, not your coins. And the video that walks you through the process on Coinbase leaves your Bitcoin or other cryptocurrency under the control of private keys owned by Coinbase. Here, we're gonna go through and show you how to execute a purchase, purchase which will end up having you in complete control of your crypto. So let's switch to my demo machine here. What I want you to do is in your browser, navigate over to shapeshift.com. I want you to scroll down to the section that talks about trading crypto without commissions, and then click on the getting or get started button. Once you do that, I want you to create a Portis wallet. Now there are other options here. If you happen to have a keep key treasure or ledger, those are the ultimate in security. But for the purposes of this video, we're going to go ahead and create a Portis wallet. And that's going to give us a prompt and this is okay. We want to continue over to Portis to create our secure wallet. So we'll say continue. And on this screen, since you don't have a password, let me move this over a bit. You're going to want to go down to the link that says create new wallet. Go ahead and click that. You're going to enter your email address and you are going to pick a super strong password and you'll then confirm that password. I'm going to do that but I'm going to cut the video so as not to expose my email address. All right, so I have created my Portis wallet and that will automatically connect that wallet to the Shapeshift interface. And so now I've got the ability to receive crypto. If I already have a wallet and I want to send it over to, uh, if I already have another wallet, and I want to send it over here to my Shapeshift wallet where I own the keys. I click the receive button, 
copy the address. In fact, if you followed that previous video and you happen to still have your coins sitting on Coinbase, you want to go ahead and click this receive button. And if you followed the directions to a T in the other video, you want to receive Bitcoin. And you want to copy this address to your clipboard. And then you want to go over to Coinbase and send those coins to this address. That's going to give you full and complete control over those coins as they'll be secured by your private key in this wallet. If this is your first vi visit to this series and you are buying crypto for the first time, click on the buy crypto button, enter the amount of money you want to spend on your crypto. And remember, while Bitcoin, for example, is trading at $15,000 per Bitcoin, you can always buy fractions. So let's say you wanted to buy $10, $10 worth of cryptocurrency. You see here that the minimum, note there in red, on the Shapeshift platform powered by Banksa, the minimum is $20. So let's go ahead and take that up. I'll say $100. 100 USD is going to get me 0 0.00622 worth of Bitcoin. Or said another way, 0 0.00622 BTC. Now, you have the ability to select your payment method using a debit card that's most likely going to be Visa MasterCard. You click Next. Banksa will pop up and give you some confirming information. You confirm your order. And you'll be given a window asking you to complete, if this is your first time through the process, be giving a, given a window asking you to fill out some contact information as well as some legal legal ease relative to the relationship with shapeshift okay for my purposes i chose not to complete the registration form just because i'm doing this demonstration in a virtual machine and i wouldn't be able to upload my driver's license and all that stuff. But simply follow along. The form is very easy to understand. It'll walk you through what's called the KYC process. So you're submitting your identification to protect from money laundering all the, and all those things. Once you complete that form, you will be able to use your debit card to buy cryptocurrency. Now I know the title of the video says how to buy Bitcoin, but some added value for you, you'll be able to buy a number of different coins, Bitcoin, Ethereum, I think Bitcoin Cash, Chainlink. I think you can even use this flow to tokenize your US dollars. That is turn your US dollars sitting in your bank account into a blockchain representation, USDC in this case, sitting on the Ethereum blockchain. And there's a video on the channel that talks about how to tokenize your assets. I'll try to remember to link that video at the end of this one in the uh, little pop-up cards. And I think that will do it, actually. You follow that flow, you will have a Bitcoin wallet totally in your control, or you own the keys. You can send the Bitcoin that you currently have sitting on Coinbase or in any other wallet to this new Portis wallet. 
and you have an interface now that is super clean, super simple. Shapeshift has done a really nice job with the product and their recent acquisition, relatively recent acquisition of Portis has only made the platform that much stronger. So hopefully you found some benefit in this short tutorial going on 18 minutes, maybe not so short. Uh, well, it'll be shorter by the time I cut some things out. But in any event, hope this is, use is useful. Leave me some comments down below. Smash the like button. Subscribe. Hit the bell to turn on post notifications so that you are alerted anytime I, I post new videos. Thank you again for watching. Stay safe. Be well. Be positive. And you will see me in the next one.